on today's episode of based after dark you know what i literally tell them i say look there's not an easier bunch of suckers to spend all the money that we have here <laughs> than these 12 right here so you better give us a table because you're about to make some money and then they're like done i've never heard anyone make something ignoble said worse that's the first time I've ever i'm heard. taking that one out Th that one's not right <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know about that. <laughs> that was... oh, I you. am you fucking tired. You know why? Yes, no, because age. I fucking work multiple jobs, okay? And I stream, so I don't want to hear any of that pussy <laughs> shit that, like, you have a full time <laughs> job. Get his ass! I don't believe I don't ass. believe this. I don't believe this. Based. After dark. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Based After Dark Season 2, Episode 41. Before we start, as always, a massive thank you to our Patreon patrons. Uh, we have 222 paid hey! patrons. Trout Gang, shout the hell out. Thank you very much, guys. <clears throat> um, and of course, uh, check out the merch, all right? We have a base.shop if you want some beautiful merchandise uh, of yours truly. My name is Tasty Life. Welcome. Uh, we have Mr. Prisonical Joseph. We have Ignoble Solid. Uh, we have the dynamic duo T Pop and Krylax in the same building. And special guest, co founder of the base team itself, <clears throat> Miss Elisa. Welcome. How are we doing, everybody? Good, good. I'm excited. Thank you for having me. Fantastic. I'm in Idaho, baby. <laughs> yeah. He is. He is. Why are you Idaho, happy dude? about being in Idaho, dude? Said I would no one ever. Hey, man, can, you get closer to the yeah. mic? can you get a little closer to the dude, mic? In Idaho? Y'all sleep on Idaho, man. I've been out here. It looks. I was like, damn, I can move to Idaho for a second. What is there about Idaho? besides his house? Tell, tell like, what is there? Yeah, what is there? Honestly, a lot of. I tried a Huckleberry for the first time. The that fuck is a Huckleberry? <laughs> I don't that's know what that is. I know, dude. I thought that was a racist right. term. What does that mean? Oh, I thought that was only... a book. Yeah, it's it's. Is that why racist, you're saying the? That's why it's so popular here. Whoa, honestly. that's off camera. That's for the Patreon. Right? The Huckleberry <laughs> pies are. They're, we didn't get to have the pie, but we had some Huckleberry lights, like mimosas and everything, and it was. Okay, what the fuck is a Huckleberry? Can you like? I I didn't know I, even that was a real thing. Dude, I didn't. I thought it was a huckleberry is a predominantly Idahoan grown berry that they put in fucking everything here, dude. Like it's it goes in everything. It's just it's only in season for a short amount of time and they have to take them all and they freeze them and we use them out for the rest of the year. But uh, they're super expensive. They're like between like 30 and 60 dollars a pound when you go and get the them. Fuck? But uh, yeah, they're like and so we went we went to three wineries yesterday <laughs> and Jesus uh, we Christ. Were, fuck. Yeah, dude, we we got fucked up at these three wineries. It was fun, and we were trying like Huckleberry mimosas, Huckleberry wines. Like it was, a, it was a good time. It was crazy. I was gonna say, I just looked it up. There's a lot of different wine that they make with these. Interesting. Is it similar yeah. to a boysenberry? Um, yeah. I mean, they market it in a way such like a like a boysenberry would be, but I mean, a boysenberry probably costs like the third, a third of a price of a Huckleberry is my guess. Like it's the 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 bro the boysenberry is the broke boy. A huckleberry is a cross. I think a boysenberry is one of the crosses of a huckleberry. A huckleberry is like three different berries combined, or maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. I love but, how much you know about this. This is, this is such a really, really, really I hate yeah. this so much. This is like dude. every oh Idahoan, bro. Like, this is how you get in. This is like Did week you have one. The you get given a this is what they call in some cultures a white people shit right here. Yeah. yeah for real. That is fine. Uh, Everyone no, has already is, clicked is, off this podcast. It does podcast not get more here. white people shit than huckleberries, dude. I was about to say, You gave us the worst five first five minutes we could possibly have on this podcast. Bro, this is why I fit in up here, bro. Do you look? Look at me. Oh my god! Like me, bro. I'm a, I'm going around there talking about boysenberries and huckleberries. They like. They're like, oh, so you look so nice. Pleasure to serve you. All yeah, right. So so Ignoble and I can white. never go. Never. What do you mean by that? Why are you lumping me in with you, Elisa? Do what do you mean not, by that? Do Elisa, not embarrass I'll, me by showing you, up. I would be so embarrassed if my neighbors saw you guys here. I I would let Elisa come. Ignoble, we'll have to talk about it. We'll yeah, I'm passing. Forward. That's crazy! Wow. I just okay. don't like New Jersey. I just I'm not a fan of New Jersey. Honestly, I, yeah, I feel that 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 that's yeah. okay. I'm I'm cool with that. Yeah, yeah. valid. Well, dude, Krylax, you've been on a on a world tour for like the past month, dude. You quit your Subscribe job in the you're Patreon to hear about it, dude. He's coming here next. Real and true. Real and true. Right? No, he's not. He's not coming here next. Yes, no, I am. Just not immediately. One because actually. <laughs> 
This is a shout out to all the base fans. Send me, send me some love because my grandma had a stroke yesterday. So oh, not man. to Aww. somber the mood, but um, yeah. So I might be having to right afterward this baby shower I'm going to after this have to go. And a couple circumstances happened that I couldn't go to Nashville to visit that, but sometime we'll complete the tour another time because we still got like the Miller Lite second trilogy. Like, How is Grandma? Is Miller she doing good? Light. She's just really old, dude. Shit just happens, you know. Aww. She's like she 85. lived. She she lived though, correct? She's alive. Yes, she's yes, alive. she's alive. But I haven't heard from my dad. Actually, it was two days ago. I haven't heard from my dad. I've just kind of been like chilling and trying not to think about it because honestly, it's gonna be hard on him more than it's gonna be hard on me. I have to be there for him. You know? <laughs> How old is she? Eighty-five. So fantastic wow. life lived, no matter what. And uh, dude, that's from my, my grandmother. Okay. Like, she, it's like the world was trying to kill her, but she wouldn't go down. She had that dog in her. My mother's side grandmother. She smoked for thirty years. Had twelve children. Like three hip replacements. Fucking fell off. Like a, I think she fell off a tree when she was like seventy-eight or something. They, they couldn't they why the couldn't fuck kill was her. she on a tree yeah, at she, a tree. <laughs> she was very um like i don't need help type she's very stubborn she was she's like i don't i don't need this i don't need i'm you're not putting me in a nursing home and uh yeah man she saw it she wrote it hard to the end respect which one of us all. do you think would be like that I, like i'm getting babied in pamford like I oh, i'm doing going like, to you're finding home, me on a tree yeah. when i'm, I'm 70 going bro, you're gonna be in a nursing home at like 35 dude just slow down dude you're fucking no <laughs> I mean, I am the oldest, I think. So, how I also you, am so? half Asian. Uh, yeah, you guys live forever. Old? You'll be. You fine. guys Just know say how 21. old I am. Just say twenty-one. Just say twenty-one. Yeah, sure, twenty-one. Perfect. Yeah. Legal. I actually don't know how old you are. Does anybody actually know how old Elisa is? No. I thought can you we all guess? Can Seth, we all guess? There's no way. Yeah, I, I guess. Please. I have an yeah, idea. Let's all take turns guessing. You know what's funny? I will get, I will get offended. 45. <laughs> I've, known yes. you, I've, I've known you so long that I forgot how old you are. That's Dude, what's we've happened. known each other for four fucking years. How crazy is that? <laughs> That's what Dude, I'm she saying. she got to be like 38 or some shit, bro. Just look at young spirit. Maybe young spirit. Yeah, hold, hold on, you, I'm hold on, hold on. You can't see my screen. Let me zoom in on her Discord. Wait, yeah, I can see those eye bags. My picture frame <laughs> and uh, dude, why I was like, don't mean? worry about it, dude. He was like freaking out, cleaned it up, and then the next day he handed me like 20 bucks in cash. And I was like, bro, chill, it's fine. It was like a TJ Maxx, like $10. It's because I was being thing. a dumbass. Like, it, it well, it was the so first time we that. met like, when you guys yeah. came to my house. So. But that's why it was like the first time yeah. I was meeting these people and I was being a dumbass and I knocked this thing off the I wall. I forgot I about like, that, shit. dude. I forgot we yeah. even met. How did you forget about that? That's I, well, when I got stuck off, in the fucking uh. <laughs> washing machine and you helped me out oh, and then yeah. we went <laughs> we also went to ago. hibachi and like they brought out the big a big ass gong and we were all just like, video so of this drunk washing machine just like hypothetically or some shit so i think there's the, clips still the hibachi was insane that's probably the most lit hibachi Zaki, i've ever been Zaki. to Zaki. that was yeah. the best Zaki. hibachi place i don't think i don't think i've ever been to a more exciting like just it was it was they electric I mean, it was crazy. Everybody's just there. The sake is getting squirted everywhere. People are yelling. They were banging this fucking gong. There's chicken flying everywhere. It was fucking. It was insane. Dude, the sake bottle had a little cupid on top with wings, and its little dick would piss the sake on you, bro. <laughs> oh, that's, that's fucking sick. That, that's I just want that. Dude, can we and then get they had that the gong, for and the gong was going crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I like, remember Zoe, or yeah, Zoe walked up. Zoe's in the bathroom, and like some kid just walked in on her, like just straight up taking a piss, like walked oh, into yeah. her stall or something. <laughs> I, remember <laughs> I remember that as well. That was, uh, yeah, I guess that was kind of the, if if we wouldn't have met, like, they should, it's, you know, think about time here. If we wouldn't have met, if we wouldn't have had that meetup, we would not be sitting here doing this podcast today, I would say. Right? Yeah, that's, was that, was that's that literally when we Boris? talked about making this stream yeah. team like yeah, that's yeah, how yeah. crazy that is yeah, yeah that's when we like talk about the whole base like making a little stream team like getting some people together and then elisa was like oh yeah we should get tasty he's hot right now i was like yeah get him surely he'll say yes and your dumb ass like yeah sure why not <laughs> I did, my dumb <laughs> you ass did say yes idiot. bro fuck yeah. <laughs> uh, i could have been in the rat pack dude i could have been funny. <laughs> <Yeah>. bro <laughs> can you I'm imagine how there, things would have been if like oh, tc just out there hanging out with abyss they're both like you know bopping to drake somewhere in the corner I mean, of the club see. just like me and abyss would be in a homosexual out. relationship at this point if that happened <laughs> yeah. I, can, I can guantee that hands down bro for sure. <laughs> Try right, you're already you taken. Stop taking rough. everyone from us. <laughs> you want a bit? Some Sorry, for the I'll, rest I'll of us. I'll leave a bit. No. Yeah. <laughs> Give you his phone number if you want. <laughs>
uh, I was gonna say, and that was, we, uh, we added you, ahead, and then ahead. you're like, you're like, uh, like, oh, this guy T Papa, I love this guy. He, you, we should, we should bring him in. He's such a, he's crazy. And I remember just pulling up his stream. He had those glasses on that Carl <laughs> X was wearing. That's when he had the fucking Supreme shelves behind him. And he was, mm -hmm. he used to be, a, he used to be a lot louder. Like, I feel like he's lowered down. I was, I was a lot louder. That's the natural <laughs> progression of streams, though. I feel yeah. Like. yeah, yeah, yeah. It that was, is true uh, though, because I feel like I was super loud. I've gone down, and now I'm coming back. I'm bringing the loud back. I feel like I'm hitting a new arc. You know, I'm, I'm trying. You know, maybe it's maybe it's the kick streamer. It's a new it's a new era. I'm not sure. I but, remember, I remember. I remember the stream when Tasty came in, and he's like, "You're based. Want to be in based?" And then two seconds later, <laughs> Elisa typed something, and they're like, "Yeah, you want it? We, we'll have you in based." And then yeah, I was. Like, I remember. Like I remember when you guys came into the stream and asked. As crazy as that is. I don't I remember believe that all three at all. Of you. Yeah, <laughs> I don't remember, I don't remember, that. remember it was either. Like, it was like, oh, but I'm that's cool. definitely something we would do. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> cool the standards were low when Ignoble and Tupac joined. <laughs> <Whoa>. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. This is not because I'm sleeping in his house, but T Papa is probably one of the most based people we have. Period. Oh, 100. He definitely he's no, up there. Sure. He's not up there because right he's sleeping here. No. Yeah, no. He was literally mm -hmm. talking about a woman pegging him while his wife was in the other room the other day. That's base as fuck. That's I did base. say that, and he wasn't there for that. And that was on purpose, and she does listen to the pod, so this is great. <clears throat> oh, Yo, Phoenix well. is We're one kidding. for the boys, though. Joke. Let's just say, like, joke. Phoenix, you know, she's, <laughs> she's down for the what? cause. You're getting pegged, buddy, okay? That's fine. All right. <laughs> as long as I don't have to use my hands, bro, I'm, I'm in. Like, let's fucking go. Real, real and true. Okay. That's so hands based. Free, hands free is good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but no, if we didn't, if we wouldn't have had that meetup, we wouldn't have met and done that. Yeah, I guess we would not, we would not be here right now. So that's pretty cool. Base wouldn't be real. I yeah. literally remember you streamed from my house and your voice is so loud compared to mine that it just kept on peaking because my mic was not as good as it is now. It was like a $40 mic because I had just started streaming. So like PJ's fucking just screaming in my loft with cry it was just so funny you got the usb mic the one that you know the i feel like it's kept like, on it's the, it's the like chat was going crazy i call that the e-girl starter mic that's the it's the usb mic that the changes Yeti? colors no no that's oh, the one that changes yeah. colors yeah that's, yeah it's oh, either like that, that. One. yeah it's a that or a yeti like that's usually like the starter mics you see typically like those are the ones i see typically now yeti's pretty good though if you if you put the the settings correct it's good because i remember for a long time I had the microphone turned the wrong way and the gain all the way up and I had a Yeti and it sounded terrible. And people were like, why do you mic sound so bad? You have a blue Yeti. And, I, and then one day, dude. one guy, I think I've told for he's like, dude, turn the mic around. I turned it around and everybody was just spamming like, holy fuck, you sound like a different person. What happened? <laughs> but yeah. Were you yeah, saying something I wonder problem? where we would be, dude. I wonder where it'd be if the, uh, the base team never officially formed, at least in that way. I feel like we would have come together at some point. I wouldn't be in a some Idaho way right now, bro. I wouldn't be in Idaho right now. You didn't. don't know that. You don't I probably know that. wouldn't. Probably not. Probably not. You could be getting baptized out there by T Papa instead of just hanging out with him. Yeah, dude. True. What do you think we've been doing? T Papa doing, would bro? still be. What do you Mormon think is tomorrow, bro? Why you could have went back. You could have relapsed. We literally with the saved T Papa. We saved T Papa from Mormonism. He could have relapsed. He had a. Yeah. There's a time he could have. They could have relapsed. It was. He could have relapsed, but instead he come to hang out with us. Back into. Come on. Bro had two choices: either dude, go down a life say. of vices, drugs, and alcohol, and women, or be Mormon. And that was always the choice. So, there what have no you guys? Choice. What have all you guys done together so far? You just went to some wineries. What else have you done? Uh, what do we do? First day, gosh, we've been a little fucked up. I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Surprise! Ah, <laughs> uh, he got here. Oh no, we had the. He got here and it was college and basketball national championship. We went and watched that game. Yeah. We came home and then uh, smoked a lot of weed and then went to bed, woke up the next day, and I was not on a lot of sleep, and Annie was on two hours, and we went we went up, hit up the wineries, uh, hit up three, then we went and got some big dinner, came home last night and rallied <laughs> and kind of partied again, uh, woke up today and have done nothing. Like, I slept 11 hours last night. Oh, we. Yeah, yeah, no, Crylax, we, we woke up and the only thing on the agenda today was the podcast and Crylax, we went to the, the grocery store and he made us some nice Italian home cooking, dude. We just ate it like two ooh, seconds ago. Ooh. It was so good. What did you make? Cast iron, what was it? 
It's um basically spicy chicken sausage, orzo, spinach, and like grape tomatoes, and it's all in one pan. It's really easy to cook, and my favorite things to make. So hey man, can we get the carbonara going in bro. Orlando again, please? Bro, the car. Me and Whale. Whale's coming to Orlando. He is. So yeah, I, yeah, I, I said I didn't know that. Shit. I will buy I the finest ingredients it. possible. I'll throw in. We need the carbonara again. Bro, yeah. I know. Would we go Italian to Kappa? Market you should. Orlando too. You should get all the. Uh, all the ingredients to make a good one at Kappa. See if it'll send us home with them. Bro, That's they'll possible. just overcharge us. So bro, is it gonna be your that. what day's your birthday? Fine, Isn't we'll your birthday while we're there, Tasty? My, my birthday's the on my birthday's on the twenty sixth, which is when we're going to Soseki. I'll so get you Louie. Birthday birthday I will get you Louie. I'll get you Louie. Louie, a little bit of Louie? If they have you. chartreuse, get me that instead. Yeah. I'll do what it for you. That's fine. That's fine. I'll do it for you. I I don't As long as you let me I gotta gotta let me partake too though. Oh, absolutely. Um, no, 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 no. My birthday is on a Friday, I think, or a Saturday, oh. maybe. That's the best. How are we gonna celebrate Mom. your birthday? What are we doing? Are we gonna like, I well, don't know, like strip so you naked, naked, put you in garbage bags? So bag and bunch None of us have been there. It's a mystery. Wait, in bed? Adventure. We're going yeah, to the bed. bathroom, in bro. Yeah. There's only one way to celebrate his birthday, bro. It's the bathroom. Okay, I'm well, going to the bathroom. Sunday. That's the day it is. But yeah, still. Oh yeah, that is true. You know, I scheduled it for that day. It's Sunday. Yeah. He's just off by two days. Oh, did you already figure out like your reses and stuff, or is that still up in the air? I have to wait hard, for. I have to wait for both of them. I have to wait a little bit longer. They do like a month to get a res. I yeah, can finesse like it. Out. Worst case. Yeah, we also have the reservation Rizzler. Bro, I am the, the reservation, reservation Rizzler, 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 truly, bro. I've called a place and like, truly. and I tried, and they told me no twice. And he called and he's like, I got a table for twelve. It's like, what? What did you do? <laughs> yeah, bro. It's happened did you a couple tell times. Them? I didn't even expect it. <laughs> I'm gonna rob the fucking place if you don't give us a table. <laughs> <laughs> bro drops his entire full name and like employee's address like yeah that's crazy anyways table for 12 yeah here's my email address my phone number we're going to rob oh. you unless you give us the best table you have honestly okay. you should tell them that us going there they can rob us with how much fucking money they we end do. up spending on stupid I, shit that's we what get I'm robbed, saying. Bro. you know what i literally tell them i say look there's not an easier bunch of suckers to spend all the money that we have here <laughs> Than these twelve right here. So you better give us a table because you're about to make some money. And then they're like done. You say <laughs> add on, but we say yes. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Well, now now we look at the add-ons. We look at them now, but we we did used to say yes. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you want the truffle? Yeah, just throw the truffles on yeah. there. Yeah, fuck yeah, it, sure. drop it on there. Why not? This motherfucker tasty this week spent a hundred and fifty dollars on a spoon. Would you like to describe what happened? I, I, <laughs> okay, oh, all right, buddy. Story. So did so did Jake. I story, so I so did Jake. Can tell it. <laughs> okay, okay. So Jake, before he's in Idaho, was here in Arizona visiting me. Um, and we did the, you know, the, the maple and ash dinner, which is the place we go pretty much every time. Fantastic steakhouse. That place. If you're in Scottsdale, I recommend. Um, in the morning of our dinner, it was like me, Jake, and my buddy Garrett, who's a psalm, Dude, who works Garrett at Garrett sold at this shit so hard, bro. He, he sold it said so hard. Anything. He's a salesman at heart, The way he did yeah, it, you know, I was like, good at it, yeah. I literally looked at him, I said, dude, whatever you say after that pitch just now, it could be anything. I'm going to probably buy it when we go. Okay. We get it. I'll, I'll give you guys the whole pitch. Dude, he sat us down, and he's like, have you guys ever heard of Royal Essentia? And I was like, no, but I'm interested. Please fucking keep going. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so not, I, I'm sure of most not. of you guys bro. in this call have had like a nice, like a, a, a dessert wine, a sauterne, tea papa, you've had some, I know. Seth, you've definitely had some. Mm. Um, so the way sauterne is made is that it's a very specific region in France, and the grapes have to be infected with this like mold. I forget what the name of the mold is, but like it's a naturally occurring mold. Yeah, and so they have to like. It. Yeah, it dehydrates the grape. They have to, like, pray that the grapes get infected with this because if they don't, if there's not enough, they just don't make anything that year. So that's how they make Sauterne, which is a very, like, a very famous type of dessert wine. There's another type of dessert wine that I forget the name of, but it's essentially the same thing. It was developed independently, like, randomly, like, 600 years ago. Oh, Tokai. Same mold. Tokai. That's what it is. Tokai. Tokai, yeah. <clears throat> yeah. And it's, it, it, like, randomly happened to find the same process, like, hundreds of miles apart, thousands of miles apart. <clears throat> and this comes from Tokai, all right? It's a similar kind of dessert wine. But when they put all of the grapes in the barrel to, like, crush them and let the juice come out, what Tokai does differently is that they just let them sit in the barrel, and the weight of the grapes crushes it itself. And the very first liquid to come out is, like, a really, really thick syrupy super concentrated version of this dessert wine 
and it's called Essentia. Essentia? Essentia. Whatever the fuck it's called. Essentia, yeah. Um, Essentia. We just lost every viewer. But go no, no, on, no. no. Tr trust me. No, no. They're excited. They <laughs> Dude, they're are on the edge of their seat right now. Is this, now, is this better or seat. worse than Huckleberries? Is that, like, it's, like, that is debatable. Right That's debatable. We we haven't tried Huckleberry <laughs> Essentia yet. I just love Idaho. This yeah. is Seth way cooler than noble, Huckleberries. Like... This is way better than Huckleberries. This is, it on, sounds cool. We don't know. I, I don't know. I, don't know. I can't confirm. I'm going to make a joke. Go on. Anyway, that that very, very first pressing, that like dripping of the thick syrupy liquid they make like some hilariously small number of bottles a year like you can't it's very very hard to find but we got lucky because like a couple months earlier someone booked out maple and ash the entire restaurant which is like a hundred and fifty thousand bucks to book Tiny. it out for the night and the head psalm is like a treat somehow had the connection to get two bottles of essentia for them <laughs> and they gave one bottle to the party and they kept one bottle at the restaurant just to like have basically. And so we looked out because there was some left and the way it's served is like this very intricate crystal hand carved spoon and they fill a spoonful and you like put it in your mouth and you like let it soak in, you let it sit in your mouth. And it's, it's like the most heavenly liquid you've ever ingested. T Papa would literally have a prostate orgasm <laughs> if he tried <laughs> Royal Essential. With or without you. Oh, those hands. are my favorite times, no hands. bro. That's no such a hands. bummer. Just the spoon. <laughs> no hands. Yeah. And so we got a spanking deal on it. Well, relatively, we got it for half off. Because the normal price is like two seventy five, three hundred or something. Yeah, two seventy five. It's like they've been trying to get rid of that shit for like three weeks. <laughs> it's it's not on the menu, dude. No one, no one ordered. You gotta know yeah, someone. Bro. You gotta, menu, you gotta yeah. know someone, dude. You gotta ask. They've been telling every single table that night. Hey guys, you <laughs> yeah, <want> please, this? <laughs> please <laughs> buy our overpriced grape juice. <laughs> uh, so bro, yeah, well, he gave us that whole spiel, and we had dude, we had. You know that yeah. sounds dumb right now, but if I was with you at Maple and Ash, and I was four it. cocktails no, deep, I would be like, that sounds great. No. Dude, you, would fucking do that. you know, you know part. how you should be excited. You know how you should be excited because mm -hmm. after Garrett told me that, I messaged Bodie and I was like, "Have you ever heard of Essentia?" That's all I said. I just said that and I put my phone down for like the rest. I didn't check Twitter for the rest of the day, and then I come back to like fourteen messages in a row <laughs> from Bodie, who got so excited that we were able to try Essentia. He like he's never had it. He asked like his psalm because he was shocker at a Michelin star restaurant Dude. that night. Um, and he had like a full blown 30 minute conversation with his psalm about this because they don't have it. They've never had it because they're not as cool as us. Uh, so, yeah, we yeah. got to try it. before. And that's, that's why I did it, because right. Max literally ordered it. Yeah. And then I was expecting it to be like, yeah, 300 bucks or whatever. And then I wasn't going to get it. He was just going to get it. And I was going to I was like, dude, all right, let me not spend that much. <laughs> and uh, he was like, well, actually, we're going to have it for half off. And I was like, Don, I got to get it. And plus, he <laughs> was it. doing it. I literally money, looked dude. to my left and Max is sitting there and looked him in the dead in the eyes and was like, yeah, I got to do it. There's no <laughs> way I can just. I was like, there's no way I can do it now. We'll bust out the Louis tray for your birthday, but you have to I'll be little, you have to be at a level of where you're going to be irresponsible with it when it comes out before we oh, get yeah. it for you. Like you have That's to be, never you know, not been the case. Yeah, I mean, I've only had it once. <laughs> when the good shit like... comes out, we are already. <laughs> I want you to give it a shake, man. Yeah. Shit, yeah. Like, <laughs> I, I want you, like, I don't want that Louis to be in your stomach for more than, like, three hours. I want you puking, like, right after we get back. <laughs> Deal. <laughs> Deal. <laughs> yeah, how hard do we go based on Orlando? It's a good question. What do you think? What are your, actually, at least, so what are your oh, expectations? Are you, dude, we're question. getting in fucking Florida. What do you mean, bro? Like, are you kidding? <laughs> we're, asking, we're, we're finally, like, like Vegas is fun. Like, Vegas is fun. Tennessee is cool. We're going to the promised land, dude. Like, this is what people talk about forever, dude. We're going to Florida. Like, let's fuck. Epcot drinking around the world. Like, yeah. I've been watching YouTube videos. Okay, here videos. we go. Like, like, if I've we get an alligator hyped. in the backyard, can we wrangle it? Like, can dude, we yeah. fuck with it? If we don't get an alligator in the backyard, I'm going to tell Jesse it's a frog, dude, and she'll fucking go out there and get it, dude. Oh, no. <laughs> she probably got a good chance. I mean, she's fucking, she's a tank, honestly. Like, yeah, respectfully a tank. She's isn't she huge? I saw a picture of her on She's Twitter. jacked, bro. She's, she's just like, she's working yeah, out, she's she's working out ton. Bro, jacked, Orlando bro. is not ready for base. Orlando no. is not fucking ready. Bro, 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 did they get seen... kicked out of an amusement park? There is Hopefully. dude. I For me filming totally. things I shouldn't film, probably. If they probably. search our bags, yeah. yes. If they search <laughs> our bags, we will children. get kicked out. <laughs> dude, I'm That's gonna fucking noble. punt a child <laughs> into the into no, the you're fucking. Not, you're not gonna get you know, near a child, buddy. You're not getting near a child. 
<laughs> what if we're going we around the world you and you know, like, feet, dude. <laughs> if I see you look, I'm t I'm grabbing your head like a fucking basketball and pushing it the other way, then we're gonna steer you in the right direction, okay? We don't oh, need your parole man. officer. Call him while we're on vacation, okay? We're gonna make this like happen. The fireworks are going off. Don't you just want to like punt a kid like when that shit's happening? <laughs> yeah, what does that I mean? do. Yeah, one hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, or like just. Yeah, yeah, T Papa. <laughs> exactly. That's. Yeah. I've never heard anyone <laughs> make something ignoble said <laughs> worse. That's the first time I've seen I'm it. taking that one out. Th that one's not really <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't know about that. <laughs> that was... Wow. Okay. Sorry, I just like, like every time There's I no go to talk. There's no way you were worried about a woman <laughs> pegging you earlier about Annie hearing it. Now she's going to hear that you want to drown a kid when you see you're like, fireworks, bro. You're, like you're going to procreate with this man? Bro, Annie, 4th of July, that's just crazy. The population be going down. Children jokes, dude. What the fuck, man? Like, come on. <laughs> Wait, okay, so back to the topic of Louie. How much is a shot of that? Like a pour? Like depends. how much? Yeah. It depends. It really depends, depends on, on where you get it at. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. If, are you guys talking getting, about Louis the 13th? Yeah. yeah. It also cool depends bottle? on like. Yeah. There's different types, but it's, my parents it's usually like 250 bucks for like Wait, a pause. You just said you have that at your parents' house? Yeah. My parents what? have it. My dad used to own a bar, so Bring he it. has like Louis the 13th. How am I going to fucking bring a uh, bring uh, thirteen thousand dollars? Uh, yeah, 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 you should but, just bring it. He's not going to notice. Put pour, pour what are we gonna, cola in it. We have to go to fucking Connecticut. I don't Can know. Can you put it we'll in just, a water bottle? That's like us. Like if we drink it out of a water bottle, drink it, Louis. That would be so fucking. Imagine a used Dasani bottle with Louis Trey. It's not like it's brand new anymore. Can you imagine that? That's better. An Aquafina bottle with thirteen thousand dollars of alcohol inside. Have you ever tried it, Elisa? I have not actually, but my you dad broken it out it. a couple of times. I'm you not at home anymore. I gotta. I know, next time I, I go home, go I will. Just for that. <laughs> yeah, depending I mean, on where you, you guys go. know I don't really drink that much. I just smoke a lot. <laughs> so, um, yeah. but yeah, he like broke believe... it out like for special occasions and shit. I just remember I mean, always being like, "What the fuck? Like that's a expensive ass." I think it's just kind of what it's for. It is really like a special occasion thing. It's usually anywhere from like a hundred ish to like low, like 250, 300 for a one ounce pour. It depends on where you get it at though. Like if you get out on the West coast, it's going to be more than if you get it on the East coast or oh, especially where West coast, here. maybe like 150 for an ounce probably, but yeah. pour is usually two. So yeah. So my dad, he used to have a bar. So actually tasty, I was going to ask you, we have like this espresso machine. Do you want it? We're trying to get yeah. rid of it. Yeah, I do. It's like want professional. It. I'd, Wait, I, would honestly, also, like, I would also like I just like have it. been figuring out how to get it to you. <laughs> a like, I'm a dead cafe ass. espresso machine is actually like not even good for home use, but I will take it. I will I'll give it to me. Okay, I'll we'll take figure it. that out. It's like a real cafe, like a huge. How big is it? I don't know. I have to ask him how big it is, but it's like you were the first person that came to mind because you just love espresso and stuff. So. I do. I do. I feel it's like got my boy good. fixed up. Got and it's clean. Pick. It's not like it's dirty and shit. That'd be funny when you move I into your new it. place and just like have all this quaint stuff and then there's just huge fucking <laughs> giant. I mean, expensive. I don't think it's that big. It, it's like nice. It's like stainless steel, I think. I don't think it's like. Yeah. My espresso machine is already big. I'm already like looking for a place to put it in my new house, but I'll figure yeah, it out. Yeah, like you have like a, it's like a, it's like a fucking V6 engine on your fucking counter. I have plenty of room. room. Give room. it to me <laughs> instead. <laughs> it's yeah, give it to size. Jake. I've already got one, dude. You can, he can have it. Okay, whoever wants it, one of the base members, take it. I'm down for it. What if we fight to the death over it at Orlando? It's actually easier if Fry takes it because he's in Florida and that's where my dad lives like half the year. So Getting that thing across from the east to west could be logistically a nightmare for sure. I mean, you're going to have to ship it via air freight anyway so it's gonna be four hundred dollars you have a machine minimum. that just pours celsius i mean that'd be nice if you just i could just I go up gas and station put yesterday, a cup under it yesterday we went to a place and we got a keg mosa where it's like a mini keg they bring out a mini keg and we're just pouring mimosas out of a mini keg on our uh table bro it was sick that, that is solid dope. i've That's not seen insane. the keg they're using the big pictures down here mini keg was legit Oh, and we did a shambong. Have you guys ever shambonged before? Is that like a beer bong with champagne? Yeah, essentially. But imagine a champagne glass. Let me see if yeah. I can find a picture. Uh, Bro, I don't so know. So they take a champagne a really glass. Basic bitch thing to do. 
<laughs> oh, it was. Me- are you kidding? I have me? the like, things you pop like, a like, Why do you see girls in? do sh- like <laughs> shampoo? It's, like, it's like bachelorette stuff. No, it's 2024. Is, first of all, this is all right. definitely some bachelorette <laughs> shit. Like we went wine tasting. What do you? <laughs> okay, well I was, was just saying like wine tasting and hands-free orgasms wine. a night with Huckleberry two popper. Wine Huckleberry <laughs> wine in the sunlight of Idaho. This was the most like girl with the traveling pants shit ever. You can imagine. Y'all are like Instagram baddies right now. I hope you like. We are Instagram baddies. We are Instagram baddies. You have some daddy paying for all your Ubers. Like uh, I posted a picture of the Shambong in the After Dark channel. Okay, yeah, that is a hundred percent. I've seen those. Yeah, that, yeah, I've seen. That's I've seen that's large true. groups of uh, women in Nashville sucking on those things around the table. <laughs> Bro, the cool thing was we ordered it right. We ordered it, and I was like, okay, this is cool. But then they're like, you can keep the glasses, so we got them. Like well, we still cool. have them. Yeah, I was super oh. stoked on that. That was, uh, you know, it was. It was like, ooh, what a exactly. Because usually, like the reaction when they tell them that at the table, there, but I was like. Oh, like you hear like this the decibel rises that was rises. me bro i literally went ah! i was so excited bro this was at the end of a second winery you don't think i was busting out my inner white bitch bro like <laughs> that's true that's true my, we all that's, got that inner white bitch mine was favorite. mine was at the surface okay i was i was surface level white bitch some of my favorite moments weird. is at the end of the moonshine tasting how everybody was fucking on that level too everybody was like just oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's literally what this was it was the same I thing i think we one of the most fun time. times is just like having everybody at the same level of blasted you know it's like oh, usually yeah. at a party there's like people at different levels some people just like having just like a drink some people like tasting in the corner just like jerking off furiously like dude can you fucking stop we're in public type beat but like no. hey it, it is what it is but when you have every single person fucked up i feel like the entire night just ends up being like an Instagram reel, shit's crazy. I love That's that. That's all. That was my favorite night there, because it was like we all had to drink the same thing, so everybody was pretty much on the same level, or at least close. And we oh, went yeah. through three the rounds. Tiny people were not on the same level, bro. The the people small in stature had to drink as much that's as true, me and yeah. you, dude. Those people were fucked up. But, all, so but that's funny. good though, because Olaf was just kissing women. It just ran to he he kissed that. No, he kissed women that were lady. kissing him. The women that's were true. Kissing that's true. Were kissing yeah, that's what? Yeah. I didn't know about this. Yes. Like, <laughs> Wait, this is what right happens. After I haven't Max been able to come Johnny to did. anything for a while. Right after so. Max dust deviled that countertop with his face, literally, I, uh, I zambonied that shit, dude. He literally yeah. zambonied that. Shit, oh dude. yeah, and yeah. You this definitely girl got covered. Right up to Olive and just grabs him by the face and starts kissing him, bro. Like mm. honestly, sexual assault. Tennessee woman. I mean, they're like <laughs> this sometimes. You gotta be careful. Yeah, like full Can on. Kiss back. <laughs> I don't know. It just, it literally happened so fast. And then people were like, what just happened? And I turned around. He was right next to me. That is so random. He wasn't even like talking to her before he or anything. It. He liked it. He liked that shit, bro. No, he it was, he was uh, game. He was, he was a hundred percent down. I think the friend was like, give, I think the friend was like, I think that her friend was like, give him a kiss. And he just froze. And like, she just went for it. And then like, it just, it happened. Yeah. True. Alcohol. <laughs> I think that's what I remember. <laughs> Moonshine's crazy, dude. We should dude. all go to a vineyard. That'd be so fun with the wine tasting. Wine drunk is so fun. I just it feel like someone's so gonna get lost. We did that. Fun, it was yeah. great. It was. Uh... Yeah, that was good. It's like what are you guys' thoughts? Drunk. What like instead of one night getting absolutely blasted off, you know, Miller Lights. Another night we just do Franzia night. Just fucking five boxes floating I'm around. Josh. Pour to Franzia. Josh. Josh. Oh, now we're talking. Bro. Was Josh? Josh. I need at least Josh. That's fine, the new, fine, that's the new thing. We all no. say this yeah. shit, but when it comes around, we're all just gonna be drunk the whole time, fucked up. None of this is gonna happen. That's yeah, but you guys, you know what you but guys it's are fun to plan it up? in our you head. Drink, right? You're you're gonna drink a fucking half a white claw. You're gonna set it down. You're gonna drink a. You're gonna open another white claw. You're gonna drink a quarter <laughs> of that white claw. You're gonna set that down. Then I'm gonna find them two hours later when I'm already drunk. Yell at you, and you're gonna say it's not me, man. And then the night's gonna go on as it usually does. That's what's gonna happen. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's so specific and so true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Dude, I just We've remember cleaning at the times, end of bro. our at our Vegas party. Oh my fucking god! After our Saturday, it was like seven in the morning. It was like me, Hamzy, and Ignoble. We're like the last ones alive, dude. We poured out at least sixty percent of the drinks that people opened. Like it was. Uh, my all favorite thing is wasted. being the disappointed father walking around. And I just I pick the drink up and I feel it's like full. And I'm like, I set it back down. Then I go to the that's, next one. That's the casualty, though. That's expected. Like, yeah, that's just what happens. Yeah, I've got, I've gotten used to it. It's, it's just it's tough. It's tough.
More so with the beer, you know? The beer, it's like a fucking, like, cold beer that someone just took a sip of and then just left. It's a sad moment, you know, for me. Yeah. White Claw, you know, that's piss anyway. But I like White Claw. It's good piss. <laughs> Can I tell you guys, you know, I've, as now, now that I've stopped streaming and... Dude, what are you wearing? Much, I'm wearing a fucking sweater, dude. This Why sweater gets bitches. Like a middle jade man? <laughs> That's who he just said. No one was telling us a story. You got a fucking real attacking. job, and you have to. You look put like on... the protagonist in a romantic comedy right now, bro. But go <laughs> on, okay, buddy. I, you know what? He's spot on. He does with that. get the girl. Can't though. defend you. Continue the story, thing, though. Yeah. That's crazy. I'm Dude, sorry, I, just to fuck with you. I thought I could get away from you know. I, I thought people could just be normal, and people are just very There's vanilla no and regular. Escape. But like no. my coworker the other day, we just we're walking outside and he just randomly out of nowhere just drops like I like he works with a team of clients who are not very smart and he's just like he looks at me just like I work with a bunch of fucking retards. I was like <laughs> what? <laughs> this guy like it it just opened the floodgates just opened. Two days ago, this same dude, we're all sitting together at lunch, me, my manager, like a lot of people in our office. He's just like, yeah, I got a PhD in neurobiology, but fuck, I got a master's degree in white women. And he just, <laughs> just the most HR violating shit. My manager is a white woman, and she's just like, she's laughing her ass off. That's the best part. She's not even just like, oh, I'm talking to HR. She was just like, oh, fucking slapping her knee and type shit. I was like. I, I thought Bro, I could get away Noble, from they're letting you around dude. the cool kids, okay? You're around the cool kids right now. We can't, yeah, we can't don't ruin this moment. Yeah, this don't dark on them, bro. This is where oh, we yeah, climb the man. corporate ladder. This is like, yeah, this yeah. is where you ascend, I think. Yeah. I assume. Dude, I'm just going like, to walk into work and just like, yell. <laughs> like, uh, fruitcake. Just something like that and be like, shit. Anyway. What? Can we, can, can, I, can we cut that? I was, I, can, can we please cut that? I, 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 I was about to. Uh, You're acting like okay. the guy who wears that sweater. Okay, stop acting like that guy. Ah, uh, dude, man. <laughs> well, okay, if you think about it, like, obviously Twitch streamers are a bunch of degenerates, but like, we're only here because we escaped the office jobs. Like, the, it's we're the same people. <laughs> we're yeah. the same exact people. That's just what you're going to find everywhere. That's just it. That's, who people That's not true. How crazy That's is it true. that saying so fucking true. retard is controversial? Dude, like, compared to the people that are, I worked with, we all are fucking retards, but we can't say it. Like what? Like, <laughs> you know how I know you're a retard is because you, you should brought tweet this that. up. You need to <laughs> tweet that. That's, <laughs> dude, that's like, a great tweet right there. Actually, holy shit! One, you can dude. workshop that. Like, yeah, content creators, we all are. Why dude, can't, can't we? Dude, can you like, just yeah. leave it like just completely? Leave it to people's imagination. Tweet something like, if I am one, why can't I say it? Or just something like that. Like, just leave that's it at that. That's a bit, okay. <laughs> that's kind of... That's a little too open, open. dude. <laughs> that's a little too open. That's a little too open. You raised that like, one a little bit, dude. It has to come from either me or Ignoble, but either way, like, it's not going to come out good. It's going to be like, oh, dang, what does T-Papa <laughs> mean by that? <laughs> Honestly, it's bad. It's bad that Ignoble is back. He's been sucked back into the vortex because now he's going to come in here and let all that fucking guard. He's going to try and encourage us. He's trying to live through us saying some crazy shit because he can't fucking, he's not doing it anymore. Yeah. Nah, You're, dude. I'm straight as a fucking arrow. Many, People are, he writes it down now to get it out, bro. He pulls the, uh, the uh, video. I have a little, and... I literally have a little black <laughs> notebook where every single day I write that word down. I just open it up one line with my fucking fountain pen, just like beautifully cursive Damn. ink. F. What? You know, why, you know why your manager was laughing at that guy, though? Why's that? She's fucking him, for sure. <laughs> that would be crazy. I have. <laughs> I. Uh, you can't no. you can't ruin it though, dude. You got you got to stay in there. T Pop is right. Don't ruin that, you know. Because then oh, you no, have absolutely. a you have an alley, you have a release. You Wait, can you can let now, one rip. It's like yeah, you know? now you I, have I, the the pass to like have more crazy tweets again. Oh, bro, I was build say, a crazy case on both of them, and then in a time of need, just play it cool. And in a time of need, just you know slide in the radar. And if you ever need anything really bad, and they try to and they try you in any way, just bring that all up, bro. And then you can just yeah. blackmail them into getting what you want. That's crazy. So smart. That's what I would do. These these kids, like a couple weeks ago over lunch, they were talking about their, um, for some reason, drug use came up. People are just like, oh, yeah, well, you know, I've done these things, but I've never, you know, I've never done coke. Like, that, that would be awful. And I, they looked at me. I was like, nah, I don't do, I don't do that kind of stuff. You know, like, it's just like drugs aren't really my deal. Like, I. It's like they go, oh, that would be awful, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah.
<laughs> that's exactly what it was. was Dude, like, your coworkers are wearing a wire, bro. That's what the fuck was going on. <laughs> it's all this elaborate ploy that the FBI has to fucking capture you and waterboard oh, you and get all your secrets. Don't rat God on us, damn. though. It is interesting to see, like, uh, what people will consider a <laughs> terrible, like, bad drug. You know, I guess people who are not as degenerate as us. It's pretty interesting to see, like, the the visceral reaction. Like, if you say cocaine, <gasps> like, it's like, <laughs> whoa, <laughs> it's like some terrible. I must be hanging out with different people. I don't. You, know. <laughs> you definitely are. You definitely are. <laughs> you definitely are. Uh, 100%. My mom found out that I smoke weed, and she literally thinks it's like. A gateway drug still. Oh, it's like, it is. Is it not? Is it, is it not? It really is. But just it so is. you know, it's my favorite. <laughs> Shut up, Papa. It. it is the a really best good gateway, gateway drug. drug. I, I, went, when, I went from no drug use to all drug use, I think, yeah. with weed. Yeah. <laughs> that is kind of true. I yeah. Even, gateway, it was a gateway to alcohol. Dude. Like, that's, that's how strong I it is. I skipped the gateway. I started on the wrong side of the gate, and then everything was just there already. That's straight into the deep end. That's crazy. Yeah. And we swim, like, baby. Yeah. We fucking swim well. That's custom here. I think I was drinking at like 13, so I'm just kind of stuck there. I did like so. four psychedelics and smoked a bunch of weed before I ever even drank. So I, I'm with Grylag. Yeah, I don't know. The, I had my the... first drink at like when I was like 17 or something. And my buddies, he, he took me over to his parents' house. And he's just like, he goes into his closet, and not closet, the fucking fridge. He pulls out like a bottle of absolute. He's like, dude, like. This shit's this shit's crazy, and I was like, "What? Like, I've never done this before." He's like, "Yeah, dude, come on, try it, try it." He like grabs two cups and pours them out. I take my first sip, and I'm just like, <laughs> "You know, when your first sip of vodka you ever?" Just like, Can we yeah. clip that? Can we clip that? Clip it. Tits, please? That's my <laughs> new <laughs> bottle. Thank you. I, <laughs> please save that for later use. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That first sip of vodka you ever have, you've never th tasted anything like it because your entire life you've just been drinking, you know, delicious things. And then some fucking vodka's poured down your throat and you just want to die. Like, why is it burning? Why does it hurt? Why am I doing this to myself? Why do people like this? You just don't understand it until you do it again and again and again. And you're like, damn, this shit's kind of nice. It is acquired. Yeah, I, I mean, that was my biggest thing is like, I mean, I, I've watched my dad, obviously, like he, he's beer and whiskey guy, like. He would drink, not like all the time, but he, he drinks, you know? Like, I see, like especially when he'd come home from work, like he'd be drinking a beer or he'd have like a glass of whiskey or whatever. And uh, yeah, I remember with my friend, we had the case of like, I forgot what it was, Bush Light, I think. It's just like fucking back then, probably 25 cents a can or some crazy shit. But I remember drinking it and it was just, it was terrible. And I was like, I have to like this. Like, my dad likes this. I've surely, I, there's a way I can, I <laughs> surely there's a way I can like it. Why is this, we were like, why is this so bad? We kept like drinking and we're like, oh, it's fucking terrible. Why was it so bad? But uh, I don't know how long it took, but it's definitely like a year or two of like, you know, getting into like for beer. I feel like beer, it takes longer to acquire a taste for than vodka. It's like vodka you can mix. You can make a nice, like you make a nice cocktail where you don't even taste the vodka. But with Bro, beer, yeah. there's not really any way around it. Like, you're going to taste it. I acquired the taste for beer when I started doing outside labor. And I would come home. That's, that's one's best. Beer, bro. That's Dude, one's best. That got me hooked on beer. I would I would drink, like, a couple cold ones, bro. And it was, like, it was pee. Something about doing a blue-collar job and then just fucking coming back and pounding a Miller Lite. That just hits. I don't even yeah, know what it is. And even, like, just being out in the... You don't have to be working. If you're, like, out in the sun all day and you're just, like, drained and you get a cold beer when you get home, I don't know. Dude. Something about it. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but that shit's crazy. Different dude, speaking experience. of good whiskey, dude, that Whistle Pig whiskey is probably my favorite. The Whistle Pig 18, dude. We had 18, some of that. That dude. shit was very good. Yeah. That beat anything I had in Tennessee. Maybe I have to try them next to uh, side by side. Dude, but that Whistle Pig was like... is one of the best. They got great whiskey. If you are a whiskey connoisseur out there listening, definitely try some Whistle Pig. Whistle Pig 18 year double malt whiskey. Outstanding. Jeez. Outstanding. Do you guys you uh, fuck with some questions? Yeah. Damn, dude. Yeah. We're on the fucking. Yeah. That's a wavelength. That's what I was about to say. Go on. Go yeah. ahead. That's yeah, what I was about to say. Fucking. How do we, you've been skin, gone, baby. too, bro. You've been missing. You've been lacking on the document, and your numbers are going down. <laughs> so, hey. just letting you know. Look, I make my appearances count. That's what happens, okay? I'm that's okay. I like that. Good time. I get down with that. Go on. And uh, speaking of foreskin, um, for, <laughs> Mr. Foreskin Puddle asks. If the base group is hardcore IRL, <laughs> who would last the longest? I mean, we technically are, first of all. 
Yeah, I mean, if we die, we don't we get are, it back. Right. Yeah. I didn't think about that. <laughs> that is Unless you're moving. Okay, so Unless do we have to we don't figure get it back. out who's Yeah, I'm die definitely first. living the longest. I'm living the longest for sure. <laughs> no, you're not. Yeah, it's me. 100%. It, 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 like, if an apocalypse scenario started, I would still, yeah, I, I almost doubled down. Probably, you would be the first person to kill yourself during an apocalypse. Just like, if the news just says, oh, there's something bad happening, you just have the shotgun already ready. It's like, I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> <Really intruded. laughs> that is a very mean thing to say. I'm the first person that's going to kill themselves. Jesus fucking Christ, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Did he you can't mean just that. Tell he was earlier. That. I don't think Elisa heard him, but he was like, he was like, look at the bags under your ass. I was like, bro, why are you being mean? I would that? never say that. <laughs> yes, you did. No. It's on recording. Yes, it is, bro. That's, that's is so on recording. Man. That's true. It's on. It's on recording. That's crazy. Wait, that's my bags you... or? Yes, he, he was talking to you. I am you fucking tired. You know why? Yes, you know why? Yes, no more? Because age. I fucking work multiple jobs. Okay, and I stream so. I don't want to hear any of that pussy <laughs> shit that, like, you have a full time <laughs> job. Get, and you can't no, get, that. get his Ooh. ass! I don't believe this. I don't ass. believe this. I don't believe this. <laughs> that's also, crazy. I'm fucking 32 God. years old, okay? That's, that's fine. But God. I can that's, pass like, for that's 20. how old you are. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. I'm, thir I'm turning 33 in May. It's okay, Ignoble. I won't gang up on you today. Hey, thanks, man. I've known Ignoble a long He's just time. far away from the microphone. He couldn't say anything. He didn't want to reach out and fucking <laughs> throw his two cents in, bro. I was just hanging out here, and at least it just fucking comes out of nowhere off the fucking top rope. Like 360. Ah, God. It hurt. It hurt. Hey, you know that MVP thing today, buddy? Nah, it's just not you today, you know? At least I'm though. trying my best. Uh Oh. Looking pretty good. Wait, what was the topic again? The topic was if, that. Yeah, sorry. If, sorry. If we were, we were gonna be I just hard. realized how dumb a fucking question this is. Like, if the base was hardcore, <laughs> I would nice last our patrons, bro. Okay, listen, yeah. we sorry, need sorry, a job sorry, and everything. Sorry. Relax. Sorry. Sorry. Great, great guy. You seem like an awesome dude, but your question is fucking retarded. Jesus Christ. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> You're not getting MVP, bud. That's for you. <laughs> you <got it> <laughs> Yo, Ignoble, you got my vote, bro. I like it. I like the heat you bring in today, dude. <clears throat> oh, um, man. Number one off. Honestly, uh, I'm going to go with Krylax as living the longest, so I'll give it to him. Yeah, I yeah, think Krylax I honestly is He's got the bit. charisma. Yeah, he's got the, the base health, the frame. Like, he's got he's got everything you need, really. I think he's. I'm going to give it to him. I'm so unhealthy. Who has the least childhood trauma? They'll probably last long. Bro, I... I'm not healthy me. right now, bro. I probably live the. I live, yeah, bro. I Dude, Bob is taking Ozempic and is talking about how living is, bro. He's like fucking 28. <laughs> 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 no, no, dude. He's he'll outlive me, bro. He has J Jason Smith or whatever his name is. <laughs> Joseph Smith. <laughs> Joseph. You call him Jason Smith. Hey, don't want to say <laughs> Jason and Jason Smith are tied in for the Giants, dude, bro. Forgot, you talk about? I forgot, bro. I forgot. <laughs> No, uh, but no, I'm definitely, I'm going to die first for 100%, bro. I have all your, I like, I get everyone addicted to shit. Allegedly. Allegedly. Everyone vapes, because that one time I brought four vapes in, in the Vegas or whatever, and then everyone bought vapes after that, and said so we're all <laughs> disgustingly addicted. Um, I like this one. Uh, I have a topic here. It's from Moogie. He's a longtime patron. Shout out to you. I will not call you names. Um... <laughs> If you could make any type of animal your pet, what would it be and why? Any animal in the world, and they have to listen to you. Like you command them, like you can you can communicate with them. You can have any pet you want. You can get crazy, you know. You can be Eagle? like Mike Tyson or fucking no. like tiger. There you go. <laughs> okay. Is that what you said? T Papa's on a fucking like. I don't know what it is. Don't He's distract. Just, don't don't you both I mean, you guys if, if are failures. Pick, don't if we don't distract. That, <laughs> dude, if we can pick that, I pick that. But if He's with me. If, if we can pick that, bad. I wish Krylax was another there. square on the podcast so I could feel like we have more control here because T Papa and no, Noel brought a hand today. He, I think he already took it from my head. That's exactly what I was gonna do. I was gonna do okay, good. Dude, dude, we need more control, bro. Real in, real in, Krylax. Can you imagine, nah, bro? Honestly, like if that <laughs> no, if that please. was a cho if that was a choice, then I could see <laughs> that perspective. But on a real note, a bald eagle because it's protected by the Ooh. law. Hell yeah, brother! And it can do like cool shit, and it's massive. Okay, that hold on. True. Think about this. What if American, lean right? beef patty yeah. could put you on a leash and take you travel. for a walk? You could be her pet. You're what, not what if that's the answer? Ignoble, that's not the question. <laughs> Although, if it was, I would let lean beef patty I, okay. take me I on a walk. Okay, I see where you're coming from. All right. All right. Yeah, thank you. Someone's bear. on my side. 
I'm picking a polar bear. That's my choice. Does it have Ooh. to be a real animal or can it be fictitious? Dude, if you ro if you rolled up to the party on a polar bear in like a nice white aesthetic with a platter, it might be the greatest. It'd be like fucking Lord of the Rings too when Gandalf comes down, you know, to fucking save oh, them from the battle. Insane. Yeah. Dude, yeah. I could see that. That's a good choice. Wait, so it has to be like a real animal or no? Yeah. Yeah, we'll go with that. Okay, yeah. Real. Yeah, we can go with that. All right, I just kind of just... I don't know. I want a snow leopard. I love them. They're so pretty. And to Those be able endangered. to like, yeah, like save. I it. want. Yeah, sure. A, I want to save the animals. Thank I want you. a hippopotamus. Oh. I feel like that's that'd be good. Me oh. riding a hippopotamus at thirty miles an hour <laughs> naked <laughs> just sounds <laughs> outstanding. <laughs> when did this naked the thing come in? Why do you? I, do I'm you gonna have be primal, to... bro. If I'm gonna own a hippopotamus and ride it, bro, like we're gonna be fucking at one together. You know? Yeah. We're gonna that's channel that aggressive point. energy. You know? I love hippos. No way you didn't say lobster. Ridiculous. Yeah, but it's you kind of underwhelming. I can get, yeah, I can just get that, you know? I can buy that. I can't make, I can't just make a hippo, like, you know, it's going to kill me if I try. The <laughs> last time I went to go buy a lobster pet, I was stopped. I know. <laughs> not you should do you the okay, content, you know? dude. I, you know, I respect you for that. We're not Wait, did you actually do never that? Mind. Never mind. Yeah. Not, I was no, stopped from, per Tasty said, I can't have a pet lobster, bro. That's what he said. Those are the words exactly. I said, I didn't want you to Tasty, put a lobster a in a lobster? bathtub <laughs> in Prison Joe's bathtub in Tennessee. He wanted to that buy a live lobster amazing. and put it in like tap water. Fucking... Fucking... And we could have yeah, boiled it and eaten, eaten it, it later, oh bro. Oh my God, that's fucked up. You're getting a pet and then you want to eat it? Like... Bro, I hey, love lobster, God. dude. Yeah. If Kendrick, when Kendrick bro. died, if he tasted like lobster, Peter. oh no, he's right here. I'd eat Kendrick if he tasted like lobster when he died too, bro. Like that's, that's I gotta respect. You are really right. saying crazy stuff. Out of respect, respect. Bro is on one today. What bro did you is guys on do? one. Um, when I was in college, okay, I was a, I wanted to be a vet, and I was in a club called Goat Group, and you had your own goat. <laughs> Hear me out. And basically your goat would give birth to another goat. And for some reason, one of my goat's kids had like this neurological disease. So it like ended up passing away. And then these motherfuckers took it and made goat jerky out of it. So like next week we're in club and they're like, hey, you want to try this goat jerky? I was like, that was like my baby. <laughs> like, What's what wrong with that God? though? Put the animal to good use. You know? What is the animal? Yeah, yeah, I mean, fucking, it's dead. Yeah. I like, you know. It probably I, tastes I, better because you love it. To join the army. <laughs> it was like a few. Is that how uh, works? It was a few weeks. Oh, shut the fuck up, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Did you guys hear what I said? No, I don't know if I want to. I said. I said. I said. <laughs> I said. I thought to be a vet, you had to join the army. Shut up, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> shut up. <laughs> That's what I said. Shut I was up. Like, shut Take the, the mic. Fuck up, Take the mic, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the mic. Just Bro's trying mind, so dude. hard to be on the bottom today. It's crazy. <laughs> He's winning though. I'll give him that. Oh, bro. He's inching you by the millimeter, Ignoble. He's no, very, he's, he's, he's very got me slip. Beat. He's got me beat. All right, next topic or something. Like that. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Did anybody ever pick an animal? Yeah, I think so. Okay. I mean, um, I said I would... girl, but that doesn't count. So I'll just I'll change my answer to Discord kitten. It counts. That's my answer. Okay, fair. I want okay, I want fair. a life size praying mantis. That, that would, would be kill fucking you. Sick. Yeah, not do kill me because it's my pet. He listens mean, to me. It's my pet. Do you mean a human sized praying mantis? Because all praying mantises are life sized. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Oh this guy's God, a doctor. You're the bro. one that was being Pedantic a fucking ass. retard, dude. That's <laughs> that. <laughs> it's like asking what we would do if we were hardcores in real life. Like we are. That's just how that works. <laughs> Bro oh, corrected man. my English and then called me a retard. I fucking hate this dude. <laughs> I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> but yeah, a, a human-sized praying mantis would be fucking sick. Um, I, I mean, we got the some head off of the things they have sex with afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> um, that has part of something to do with it. Yeah, I just think they're uh, fucking cool. They like, <laughs> they literally. Your head's gonna be gone in thirteen yeah, minutes. Don't Listen, hey, what do you get that human-sized praying mantis? <laughs> Let me move to this topic. Yeah. I like this one. This is RuneScape themed as well. Mm -hmm. If one of you had to go into the inferno and successfully kill Zuck with one attempt, with one attempt, otherwise we all die in real life. Who are we? Who are we sending in there? Tasty. And we can't pick. We can't pick a cold one. We can't. It has to be anybody. A regular is on the cast only. Uh, can Could include. Wait, 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 wait. I love this at the end. 
can include nine rain if you must rolling eye emoji <laughs> Bro has like zero Zuck Casey. Bro, like, that guy hasn't even seen Inferno. Why would we pick that guy's like a rain, dude. Nine Rain's like a 1900 total I'm, player, dude. He's a I fucking normie sure. ass, dude. What a Nine Rain's the kind of guy who's on Reddit, dude. He's the kind of guy who posts on Reddit like, hey guys, I don't really know if I like this new concept. Mr. Gil uh, Gilaren, thank you for the topic and thank you for the uh, bro, the yeah, we're yes, we're you, you cannot we're pick. You cannot pick a cold right winner. Right anybody. Right. It has to be people who are like the mainstay <laughs> podcast people. Is that probably tasty, right? I'd pick I, Hamzy, I could, dude. I could oh, Hamzy, it. yeah. Hamzy, yeah, yeah, it's, it's a tall awesome pick. I would pick Hamzy before I pick me. I haven't been in the Inferno in a year. Like, yeah. Oh, more. Hamzy then. Hamzy, Hamzy for sure, because like Hamzy, like he, I feel like he's always living on the brink of death, like at all times. So like he's not gonna be scared. Like he's just another day at the office type deal. So Real? I think we definitely yeah. send him. Oh, in he's there. living the imagine? longest actually. Yeah. Like it's Hamzy. At yeah, Runefest, something happens. All the base people get kidnapped, and we we all wake up. We're like you know tied naked with our hands up and you just see ha like Hamzy at the computer naked. and they're just like you have to beat the inferno otherwise all of your friends are gonna die you know like some saw shit tied they'll up start laughing naked. I what? guarantee you Hamzy would be like <laughs> okay you literally would laugh bro Tasty's gonna be like oh you're gonna you'd be freaking out but Hamzy He's just gonna laugh. Oh he yeah, definitely. no, I'd crumble under the pressure. Dude, uh, um, speaking of Hamzy, uh, Ramadan is now over, uh, and he is 17 beers deep. So shout out our boy Hamilton, bro. He's- Did he text you that? Really sending it. Uh, no, look at the Snapchat in the base group, dude. Oh God. <laughs> I was gonna say, so Hamzy, Hamzy's He's gonna doing be gone from us for a couple weeks. And when he comes back, I assume we're gonna have some quite some stories to go through. He, maybe he made them up, oh, maybe he real. didn't, but I know that. They're gonna be there. Oh my god. A story's a story. <laughs> Let me read his caption here. My dumbass server forgot to ring me up for one of my 17 beers. Lamau, get wrecked, idiot. <laughs> you think he just forgot how many beers he actually drank and is saying that? Uh, I think he forgot. God. He did counted wrong or something. No, he's, he's like, probably ah, got just. Him. It yeah, felt he's like uh, 17 beers. <clears throat> Except for me back. For the Patreon beers, today, though, I believe though? we have. Don't you and. because. You and uh, Max have a story for us, don't you, Crylax, on the Patreon today? Yeah. Oh, you want to talk about the uh, the music festival? Is that what you talk about? No, it's going to be... Yeah, we can, we can, so we can throw that on the Patreon, guys. I was just making, I was making sure you guys had something. If you are a Patreon listener, we have a little little juice for you today. Just a little something. Love a little to something, see it. man. Ooh, little I, I got a fun question. I, I like this. I think this is a good question. Mr. Telstra, thank you. What tactics would you use to ensure your safety in jail? Oh, the first day I'm walking I feel like in. Like T. Papa thinks about this more than a lot of us like, probably are, should. Are you in jail? Like you're in jail for life. Sure, it doesn't say that, but that's okay. So I'm in jail. And it doesn't matter. I'm going in first day. I'm killing somebody, and then I'm Ooh, going. Good idea. And then I'm joining the white gang. You have to. That's not really a choice. You have to. Yeah, and that's how I live. <laughs> the guards are like, bro, you're not even in jail. Why are you doing that? <laughs> <laughs> you just walk into jail and murder somebody and then fucking join the gang. No, dude, you, you get, why are you here? <laughs> you get pulled over for two grams of weed and you do that in the county jail, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to submit my place. There's yeah, a, a, really <laughs> a shot caller in here. A shot caller. Uh, that's what that's what uh, uh that's typically what uh people are referred to as the people in power at least in the uh in the dynamic um i'm gonna i would think the best thing is you want to keep low but if uh if you get offered like something that's good for protection you take it that'd be my advice but i've worked in prisons and jails so i feel like i have an edge i think i can't let them know that though because then they're gonna fucking kill me probably yeah if they find out you're so, a cop yeah so oh yeah Kroger's gotta play good. gotta play it cool as i can it's so different for me because, like, I'm a female. So. Women's prison, uh, women's prison, women is just like a completely I, different than men. I feel like, like I would just have day. to be like flirty with. The girls. I was gonna say you're gonna have to give up something, <laughs> and you'll be just fine. It? You'll be just fine if you give something up. Honestly, <laughs> you could also just give yourself AIDS. What? What? what the fuck? You could tell. Well, you already tried that. Well, you could I tell mean, people. I mean, I wouldn't mind. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. That is not true. I did not try to give myself AIDS. Sorry, HIV. My bad, dude. No, Whatever I you want to call it. I actively avoid it, but <laughs> my wiener you went inside. You didn't, crazy. Try, you didn't try that hard to avoid it. I tried pretty much as hard, bro. <laughs> I tried as hard you as you could. You put yourself in the position where you had to try okay, to avoid it. Okay, but that position was pretty fucking nice, Max. No, I would have done it nice. too, bro. 
I would have. I wouldn't even. I would have gotten full blown AIDS for it. I got you. I get if it. You, and I didn't. I got so a question. We're W. If you put your wiener inside, but it doesn't touch any of the edges, can you still get AIDS? Can you no. do that? No. That's yeah. a skill. What if you have the like a really, really in one spot? Penis. Usually, Who's pussy yeah. is like that. No, Who's what, penis what if is hypothetically, like that? not me, but yeah, you know, somebody that. maybe in this call oh. has like a really like skinny penis, like you know, like very like re, like girth is I like. I think we're all pretty like girthy men in here. Yeah, but still. Okay, I. Never mind. We're all pretty good. <laughs> Would you? Never mind. I'm not going to explore this any further. That's okay. The okay. point is, I didn't try to get AIDS. Who would do that? Bro, but you're really defensive going... about this. I just want you to know Dude. that before we go on. <laughs> that's, that's a wild statement. That is a wild statement. <laughs> to actively I mean, try, dude. At least, they have at least gotta be getting now. something. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, money. But I'm not Magic Johnson, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, yeah, but imagine... it's like available to most people now. I mean, I'm sure it's super fucking expensive because pharma, but yeah, I mean, what do you guys? Do? Anyway, no, go ahead. What are you guys' thoughts on the solar eclipse? That was this week, wasn't it? Oh yeah, we looked. Dude, I looked everyone at, at work wouldn't shut the yeah, fuck cool. up about it because they're all in Maine and they got. It's like, a very bad chess, like white people yeah. event. I think. Yeah, yeah I, I feel so bad. Yeah, it really is. It I feel cool. so bad to if that's something they're like, going, did you to. see the I live in DC? I can't see shit. <laughs> I can't like, see shit right fuck, now. That's what I kept saying. People are like sending pictures <laughs> of the solar eclipse. My coworkers all took Monday off. I'm like, what the fuck? Bro, I saw the same. I saw the same solar eclipse picture on Twitter 55 times that day. <laughs> Dude, I, oh, no. yeah, I had coworkers literally story. fly to the middle of America. He's like, I need to yeah, be in the path of totality. Like, I can't. Where I live right now, we only see a partial eclipse. I need to see complete. Oh, here's, a, here's the main reason I wasn't interested because in 2017, there was a solar eclipse and I got to like see it clear as day. I had the little glasses. Same. It was great, whatever. Yeah. So, like, this time I just didn't really care, but that's just me. I'm, I'm not going to hate if you. If you wanted to go see it, you know. It's not gonna have for another twenty years, I think. So you know, it's, get it in. This I guess. one's like special because, whatever. There's videos and shit about it. But you're a doctor, dude. Fucking tell us. Were any of yeah. you I don't close fucking to know. Like... It's like a there's like a moon here and the sun here, and then they just like do a little like type this thing. Ah, you're just like ah, oh, it's just crazy. You can't line it up type beat. There's the ignoble we know. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Just took his coworker I some I liked slurs. It. I, I liked the example you gave. That was good. I thought it was good. Thanks. <laughs> did you just try to? Did you just say you want to call me some slurs, Elisa? No, that I you said, said it just took your coworker to do. say some slurs. I do. Like, can we? Uh, um, can I? Can I read this topic? I like it. And then maybe we can do the Twitter workshop after this one. But I like this topic. Yeah, yeah, Shout yeah. out to Mr. Shabby RD, former Tier Four patron as well. Um. He said, everybody in the call is now ahead of a government agency. What department slash ministry are they in charge of? Um, pick for CIA. each other. Pick for each other. And then they, Damn. yeah, we have to pick for each other. Mm. Loki, I'm giving T-Papa giving... the treasury. I'm going to give uh, Ignoble Child Protective Services. <laughs> yeah. CPS, baby. Oh, hell yeah. He's going to get your kids, kids gonna... and he's not going to give them back. Sorry. <laughs> They're going to be protected, all right? I'm going to oh, have a man. fucking basement full of them, dude. It's going to be crazy. <laughs> okay. Like a government <laughs> basement full of them. It's going to be a fucking warehouse of kids. And oh my God. And then like all those rich white people who are like, ooh, I, I need a foster child. Ignoble. I will take them on tours of the basement and be like, have your pick. Take anyone you want. Ah, the colored ones are over here. Bro, like, do you like how many so of those good. do you think the government <laughs> and the elite you're... have right now? Like, like there are basements of kids that the elite and the Illuminati pick from, most likely. How oh, do you probably. know that? Yeah, wait, what? Four chan. <laughs> <laughs> I saw a Twitter thread that was really convincing. That someone's house <laughs> looks like a demonic symbol if you look at it. From Come on, you guys, you guys aren't on four chan. What the fuck? Dude, that's where I get all my news. <laughs> uh, mm. I give um, T Papa. Department of Defense, I think. Dude, I'll Ooh. a Treasury and Defense, man. You guys like me. You guys trust me. I like it. I'll, 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 I'll get Tasty Treasury so they can buy some just ridiculous shit that we probably don't need. Oh fuck yeah. I'm plating the White House in gold. Um I don't know what to give you. Can we you, still though. call it the White House it. though? And in, wait, I didn't mean that in a weird way. The gold house. Yeah. I'm, I okay, buddy. What are the options here? EOD? Yeah, there's a there's a lot, but well, um, PJ. Thank you. I'll take no, I'm that. I'm giving I'm giving okay. Homeland Security to, to to PJ. That was the other. Oh, thing. that's a good oh, okay, one. Okay, that that's makes more one. sense. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Homeland. I'm Security. gonna collude with no monkey to make another tragedy to fund the to get the military going again. <laughs> Ooh, I got you guys. Smart, juicy. <laughs> I mean, the Department <laughs> of Agriculture. 
Oh, for sure. He's in the in the oh, yeah. farm. That'll be him. That's a really. Would good you make one. waterboarding legal? That's true. It already kind of is. It is if you're cool enough. It's yeah, no, the, the government is definitely doing some fucked up shit interrogating people. I can tell you that. I, oh, I actually what? went down a rabbit hole. If I found out we weren't Whoa. good at interrogating, I'd be pissed. Do you imagine? Yeah. There that was like some guy, he, he's like, I would tell the government my secrets. <laughs> Turns but out when you don't interrogate people on American soil, there's a few extra things you can do to them, allegedly. Dude, I recently <laughs> read about that. I actually didn't know about this. I only recently read about like the black site in Afghanistan. I think it was like Abu Ghraib or something like that. Oh, it yeah, is fucking great whatever it is i don't know how to, it's fucking crazy what people did and pe america's just like mm, it was you know they deserved it it was it was for defending our nation okay yeah, yeah there's crazy. a couple articles about it but the journalists all killed themselves i don't know it's, it's crazy uh oh Anyways. i can't pick anything for no i can't think of anything I don't know any departments. Like, what? What the fuck? Is I don't there? want to do education because that just that lumps you in with kids again, and I don't want oh, you wait, near that. What if? You know? What if we I gave T Papa? Maybe. Yeah, I put you. T Papa on that. should get the Food or and Drug Administration. FDA, yeah, the Papa, FDA. that's crazy. He should get the FDA. FDA. Dude. Bro, yeah. bro, oh, fucking cocaine legal. Nah, I've you never done it. It's not, that's not what they do, but okay. Off days, yeah. eight thousand calories a day is a normal diet. It's fine. <laughs> You're gonna be okay. Calories a day. <laughs> It'll be fine. Bro's it's gonna ban okay. vegetables. Be like growing carrots and shit is illegal now. <laughs> oh, well, carrots fucking God. suck, dude. This should be illegal. God damn it, dude. <laughs> carrots are fine, dude. <laughs> you don't need a carrot with peanut butter on it. We're fucking killing you. Yeah. That's <laughs> the have additive. Uh, okay. This is a two-part question, by the way, by Mr. Shep Blardy again. Uh, the second is, mm -hmm. who is the freakiest in bed? Who's the most vanilla? Nicole. Well, some of us in here Ooh. don't have sex, so how can most of you noble participate? Dude, yeah. I'm out of this. I'm a virgin. That I have a blow. I'm waiting till marriage, guess. personally. I'm not going to get myself most vanilla, but I probably, I probably won't go most freaky either, just because I don't... I guess we really don't know, you know? Like, we kind of have an idea. I'm Papa most freaky, because he yeah, keeps alluding to weird shit. Yeah. You know? I'm going to be honest. I'm going to go the complete other direction. I'm going to say T-Papa's most vanilla shit. Him and Annie only have sex in missionary, and if Annie tries something different, he slaps her. He's like, no, get back in, mis get back yeah. in missionary. This is all I do. <laughs> Holy that's fuck. A little, that's a little kinky in its own way. Yeah, you know? yeah. Say, that's a little freaky. <laughs> Honestly, it is kind of freaky to make your wife only have missionary sex with fun. you. Like, that's kind like, of freaky. No, Joseph Smith only allows missionary. You mean Jason? Um, Jason. Jason. Jason Smith. Jason Statham or whatever. I would say, like, I'd want to put myself middle, but I just think after seven years, I'm probably not. You know, I probably am a little bit. I don't know. It's hard. It's hard to gauge. I It'd feel be, like I'm less. I would actually like to revisit the question in ten years and like rediscuss it and see where we're all at. I think that would be fun. Someone can someone Do write like that a down. Benchmark now and then yeah, I'll put yeah. it in my calendar. I'll put it in yeah. my calendar. Ten years yeah. from now, let's revisit this question and like, because I feel like it's a little bit hard to dive into, but I feel like in ten years. Yeah. Yeah. Like a 10 year okay. how we are 2034 current. yeah who is the freakiest april this will be really easy to remember because it's like a week and a half before 420 so yeah i, I put it in my calendar what's so the base after our podcast look like in 10 years Jesus also if you're Christ. listening four million would you watch the base after our podcast are you gonna watch us in 10 years put a one in the comments if you think you'll still be listening to us one. Especially after today, like if you don't type, I don't. We got Huckleberries, we got Ignoble Ace. It's a tough go today, but we appreciate you guys. Thank you for watching. The Huckleberries. Thank you. Thank yeah. you, Lisa. You came on. You really have. Uh, you felt a lot. Also, the dog back there is. He's having a good time. Or yeah, she actually. Gone. What were you? What were you saying, Elisa? You were about to say what? some. Oh, I said that you don't have sex. So how could you be in that <laughs> question? Oh, I was gonna say. I just think that. <laughs> No, that that's that's cool. I'm Anyways, like, that I like murder. handed the mic to you. I'm like, hey, you know, you're like fucking Kanye, who just like George Bush doesn't like black people. That's that's like what you did to me. You just fucking George Bush me. You just 911 to me. Okay, that's what you just fucking did to me right now. That was those such are two. Why does it sound like like racial? I don't understand. Immediately. Write that down, Santos. Write that down. Damn. Yeah, Sky's back there. No, I was just gonna say I don't think that I'm like as vanilla as people think I am, but. I'm I also didn't think private. that. I didn't. Uh, oh, I, so you, you think know? I'm a freak? Yeah. <laughs> yes, 100%. Yeah, no, no, no. <laughs> seeing you in Twitch chats, etc. I'm going to show you say you're definitely I just a freak. say crazy shit because I just don't care. 
If we're being honest, I'm you're definitely based. a freak. Oh, I know. I'm having, I'm having sex with no, like Taylor Swift out here, dude. I'm fucking, you know. You, I bet Taylor's a freak, though. Christ? For real, she probably you is. So? Yeah, well, she probably takes like classes for it. You know, that's the level of wealth she's at. So, I wonder if they offer that. How to be freaky? Oh, for sure, for sure. You think so? Yeah. If you, you can think of it, there's somebody who's Taylor overcharging Swift's for it. You know. In bed. I think she. I think there's potential that. Swifty's a freaking yeah. bed, yeah. I mean, she I could know. be like doing some what, what, Illuminati. I don't understand. Ceremonies. She's been through so many breakups now that she's definitely like she's at the guac guac at least three thousand. Like, what is a some, what is a freak you know? like? Like I, that's what I understand. Like every guy like is freaky. getting your balls licked. Like freaky? is that weird? Because like what guy like wouldn't <sighs> like that? You know, like what's that's who, like what the human don't being? Like that. Who what human being doesn't like a little gooch goblin? You know what I'm saying? That's Just <laughs> a little taint like a. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, but so like Gooch everyone goblin. everyone probably signs up for that shit. So I don't even think of that that'd be freaky. Like, I think wait, no no, I think what you're onto right freaky? now. I think I think what you're onto is everybody has the potential to be a freak, but I mean you are for you go for it. Like as soon as you like once you enter the sexual domain, you go for it. Not that you have the potential to do it, you just you go for it. That's the freak. The freak goes for it. The freak grabs the balls and sucks them. The freak licks mm. on the fucking thing. The, the freak tries to put a finger in your ass and doesn't ask. That's the freak. <laughs> And that's what we need in this country. Fuck. Dude, if you if you gave me that speech <laughs> and you were running for president, <laughs> like I would I would Honestly, I would I vote totally for you. I agree. Like, I hundred percent agree with everything that he just brought up. All those points were thoroughly thought out. Vote for me for Department and... of Homeland Security, baby. Yo, look, yeah. all I'm saying is if, if Donald back. Trump said that, I'd be like, yo, fucking put that MAGA hat on Bring me, bro. Bring the freaks back. <laughs> Let them Bring out. The, make make them freaks back. great again. I'm just very open with, again. like, things like that, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alexa, shut up. And it's good to ask, Alexa of course, but like the free. freak, the freak definitely just you know you gotta go. If you're a freak, I feel like you just go for it, you know. Alexa, just like as, some shit, I think. As a dude, you you, I feel like you can't do that. You can't just like com like go for something wild. You can go for it, but like there's just, like there's like a, there's like a communicate comfortable... about it first. That's a... yeah, exactly. Yeah, like, yeah. You can't just like fucking be like, ooh, hey. Well, also like That's... you have to like build a bond ooh, hey. with somebody. Yeah. You're not going to just like do the ooh, hey. shit with like a random. By the way, I'm grabbing yeah. your fucking hair. Never like, well, that's, that's, why, that's what I mean though, twice, is like so the freak no is going to ask those questions immediately. They're going to be like, yeah, they're, obviously you want to ask. You don't want to just fucking do something with no consent. That's obviously not good. But like, I'm saying like in that first encounter, you're going to ask like, hey, can I do this? Can I do this? Can I do this? Because a lot of people wait, you know, like they build the, you know, you, you get more comfortable and then you do that kind How of stuff. How many hinge but, messages before you can ask if she does anal? One. Depends how it depends how good I mean, you are hey, listen, the vibe is there. I mean, yeah. it depends how hot you are. The hotter you are, the <laughs> sooner you can ask. Do you think that women, yeah, women are more wait. open to just... anal? The more they like you, like they're, they're they would give up that, like they'd be more inclined. The more like they are attracted to you. Well, it depends if they like it, you know. Yeah, I would say it's a them thing, or just like willing to try. Like if they trust you, they'd be like, yeah, I'd be down to. Try things. Well, Bro, what um, the fuck are you guys what do you think the what do you think the fa what do you think the factor for that is? Though, is I'm asking you as a woman, what do you think like the main factor for that? Like, like if like when a guy asks something crazy to do with you, like you saying yes or no, like what's the main factor there? For me? Yeah, if if you could generalize a little bit for women, I mean, you know, women obviously. You're oh, men with a lot are of women. trash at talking. <laughs> on so Hinge, what? men are trash at talking on Hinge. No, nah, it's valid. <laughs> That's it's fair. like so confusing. I don't know. I mean, I haven't been on Hinge in a while, so because it's just it's bad. Are you not supposed to just like say hey with like a wave emoji and then expect them to respond? I just with think the were there guys asking emoji, you probably. to have anal sex like immediately on there? No, uh, not on Hinge. That's like a okay. Tinder thing. <laughs> Tinder's like you get your, get like a lot of <laughs> it's like add me that's on Snapchat me, right now, thing? and you're like, no, I'm not gonna fucking. Dude, it's real out here, Dude, people, people are, are people crazy. crazy shit, yeah. you guys. Listen, it, you I guys doesn't even. Tinder. Okay, Sends I'm a female a streamer. Anal. All right, like as a female streamer, it don't matter. It doesn't have to be an app. People will just straight up like come in there and be like, I want to have anal with you, and you're just like. Bitch, I'm posting that I'm like playing RuneScape right now. <laughs> like, what do Let you me mean? kill Om, please. <laughs> like, I'm busy in a raid. Like, That's a perfect time to respond to their tweets. So it's like, hey, going live on Twitch. And you're just like, hey, anal question mark. <laughs> anal question mark. <laughs> That'd be yeah. great. There's it's funny a... because people do that. It's, that's why. Yeah, yeah. That's what makes yeah. it so funny. Yeah. No, oh, but yeah. um, I don't know. Depends. I'm just I would asking not for, ask you know, people. 
Appar apparently yeah. our podcast uh, demographic is like 98% men. So, you know, if you could throw throw them any bones, that's why I'm asking. Throw many I'm bones. Don't ask a too. woman on over the internet if she wants to have a... <laughs> ask her if she Here, wants I'll to go throw, on a date. I'll throw you a bone Good advice, good advice. I'll throw some flowers right. or give plushies us some, or Give us some, some wisdom, wisdom. Give us some wisdom, daddy. Yeah, Get you guys need a Riz lesson? I got you. App. Yeah, True. honestly, Fuck dating real. App. Get off the dating app. Go out. Walk up to a girl, Whoa. even if she rejects, just walk up and try to talk to them. You gotta just get experience and get rejected, and then Bro, you get are you better. my life coach right now? Let's dude, I'm go. telling you, that dude, you get you better. Right. Get so up course. and go out. <laughs> Touch grass, sunlight, vitamin C. Let's come who's, slow gonna down. <laughs> who's gonna carry the boat, man? Who's, who's gonna, gonna carry, carry what her name boat. is? <laughs> okay, you know, get rejected there a couple times. Perfect. You know, second option, go into your pocket. You gotta. And you won't get rejected life is good okay we'll cut that one out you guys have any tweets today yeah like, can we do the twitter yeah, workshop? please cut that please cut that. Please cut, fuck, that please cut that holy shit uh, well, we i was nervous about coming today. on to this podcast I've, you brought out the time. worst in ignoble but ignoble is thank you thank you for what? making me look better uh, I, want you to be um, I want you to be comfortable i am yeah. Okay, okay, let me go ahead and put mine in. Mine mine has oh. a picture. Okay, mine has a picture. I'm gonna put it on Parmesan uh, cheese is like uh, throwing money on a stripper. <laughs> right, let me let me put mine first. It's, it's mine has a mine has a picture. I'm gonna put it uh same as you can throw this up. Someone I was talking about the other day on my stream about the prospects of me wearing a sundress, like how much attention I would get in one. And someone just like ripped this in my Discord the other day. So I was gonna post this photo here and I was just gonna say sundress season Jesus with the with the nail with the nail time emoji. That was gonna be my my tweet tonight. That's a pretty good photoshop me in a sun. That's dress. a pretty good <laughs> That's a really good photoshop. Yeah. No, no, that's that's a photoshop? I, yeah. I, I, exactly. Like I mean, like, would you? I mean like I look pretty good in the sundress, I mean, honestly. Just the quad's coming out nice. Oh yeah. Yeah. No toes, no free toes. I say. Okay, buddy. That's a pair of drumsticks. But uh, yeah, no, I'm gonna, no, I'm, gonna I'm gonna throw that out with the sundress season because it is starting to warm up here, and we love sundresses. You know, for our two percent demographic of women who listen to this podcast, we love sundresses. Thank Dude, you. Dude, sundress. I can't season's wait my for favorite. sundress season. We Actually, love it really sundresses. is right now. Re fucking yeah, tweet, bro. That is so real. Sundresses are the I best mean... thing ever. I wear so that true. all the time. I'm getting out of the ball with this one. Dude. So I'm gonna That's tweet that. Good. I'm also gonna put the little nail, little nails with the nail polish emoji. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Go on though. T Papa has something crazy. He's 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 whispering to Krylak. Like, you muted your mic, dude. Are you serious? He muted his I know, mic to talk about it. I muted the it. mic because me and me and Krylak are cooking up a tweet earlier. And he <laughs> okay. So I when I was making dinner, I was putting Parmesan cheese on top, and I was like, uh, I forget what Annie said, but I was like, yeah, you, it's just like throwing money on a stripper. You never want it to stop. Or something and then t papa goes you should tweet that but he just said parmesan on pasta is like throwing dollars on a stripper <laughs> no hold on i just had it i had it it was uh oh yeah throwing parmesan on pasta is that i, I guess that is what you should fuck okay there's That's something there said. yeah I knew it. No, it's a any problem. help here fellas you know we're, we're working we should on leave that one in the kitchen you know <laughs> Yeah, maybe it's. A, hey, dude, I, that one I, you know, dude. I, I came prepared. This is this is Crylax's last minute school project. I was helping him put something together. <laughs> All right. Um, throwing cheese on my pasta like she a stripper. Some shit, maybe. That's, that's, that's getting that's, a little better, little actually. Better. Yeah, I'm surprised. The idea is there. Um, we. Uh, sorry, go ahead, Alyssa. I feel like you could, you could kind of like work it in a way. Cause you know, like, uh, of course, like at the restaurant, they come out with the cheese and they're like, you know, churning it out and you don't want that shit to stop. Like the, the real glutton in you does not want you to tell them to stop. Hmm. I feel like you'd base something around that. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure. All right. Talking say, what, you, what were you going to tweet? All right. So I have two, uh, Blorva being untradeable only hurts poor people like me. <coughs> what? No. What? All right. Um, I, are you like actively trying to take like all right, worst? All right. oh, I just man. no, it, it didn't hit. I understand. These, no. is, these are in the drafts. It's okay, it's okay. Um, it's crap. It's, uh, yeah, ball it's tasty crap. is cool, but I miss four loco tasty. Fuck the hell, man! 
I was bald, first of all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, I wish bald tasty wasn't also four loco tasty, but uh Four <laughs> Loco Tasty was more valid. quite an arc, dude. I feel like I feel like you're just kind of lost in your life for a couple months there, but Ooh, you've I, made it out. It was like two weeks, dude. I, I mean, so much hey, fun. I don't Max, know. It's like a longer time. Hey, or maybe I go, made it I go uh, uh, Four Loco Tasty was just so much more fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's, 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 that's pretty good. How, how about, how about this one, one. T-Papa? Yeah, Bald Tasty is cool, but I miss Four Loco Tasty. I'm doing the other one. Four the other one's more mean, but I'm doing the other one. Four yeah, loco. You, you had the good one. Tasty was Dang just it. so much. Yeah, so much better. It was so much more fun. Right, Have you seen taxes yet? Yeah, I, I did. For an extension. <laughs> just do your taxes. What'd you say? What the do your fuck? Fucking taxes, taxes, fucking taxes. Bro, I'm filing That's for an so extension too, my man. Rejected. Okay, you know I, I respect. Dude, what are you that, doing? Dude. Okay, just be so a real I have man. a tweet based off of this. Re be a real Go man on. and throw your tax at your dad's accountant. What are you fucking doing? Well, I have still have to calculate my expenses and everything. Dude, last time I, I used my You just give him all the documentation. Ask... Let him do it himself. Michelin That's dinner good. one. Michelin last dinner time I two. Used the accountant, they charged me nine hundred dollars to do my fucking taxes, and I was like, "Sir, like that's crazy." So I just did TurboTax this year, but I owed so much it was so fucking annoying. But okay, so the tweet. It's kind of like, it's like blunt though. I don't know. It's like. Well, tweets are good if they're blunt. Okay, okay. I was going to write, whose dick do I got to suck to get a tax uh, deduction or something? Like that. <laughs> there's a few. That's pretty that's good. Perfect. I mean, I owe literally like leave the or something at the a... end. <laughs> 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 like the or something was perfect. That's the, I yeah. think that's the best tweet we've had so far, honestly. Okay. Yeah. I, I actually I like that one. You like me in a sundress? What the hell, whose man? dick. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll tweet it. But I was That's like, like Jesus. You like, gotta wait though. You gotta wait. We're gonna tweet at the same time. Okay, oh, yeah. I put it in the draft. I mean, we well, I got, other drafts. I got, I got nothing one. safe for podcast or work or anybody. <laughs> My problem was I listen when T Papa goes like tweet that, and I should have been like wait. Right, <laughs> yeah, T Papa said nothing. Okay, okay. it would have been be, it would have been like most of you guys, it. most weeks. I show up with I try to show up with some words. That you know, I'd rather get railed than not have like anything, you know. Dude, like I'd, yeah, I'd rather, so I'd rather. So yeah. I liked your tweets today. Thank you, thank you. Uh, I got a pretty bad one. Um, All right, I'm not go. gonna tweet it. <laughs> hey. I'm not gonna tweet this one, but maybe Ignoble will want to tweet it. <laughs> um, what is a racist pirate's favorite word? The hard yar. <laughs> that, that's so that's bad, even, but I just laugh because of how bad it is. It's pretty that's bad. Bro, bad the, the responses, the Twitter gremlins that that oh will oh God. wow. <laughs> I'm not posting I don't that. Think that's I'm not gonna post that one. Bro, they're what? screenshotting hey. you and talking to you, like talking about you, you know, and all the discords. Yo, Seth, yeah. post that on the Behemoth account. No! <laughs> Dude, I was joking in a, I was in a call last night with somebody and I was like, I was making the Behemoth document. And I was like streaming like me like doing it and like I went to the Twitter account and they're like you want to tweet something crazy and I just typed in all caps on like the thing like I love big fat booty <laughs> like the Latinas or something like that. And they're like I almost tweeted it. I was close. They were offering me. I was getting incentive to tweet it but I didn't. The funniest thing was is I said <laughs> that. I said if I did tweet it, Tasty would immediately hit up T-Pop and be like what the fuck dude? Why'd you tweet that? <laughs> dude, we should totally tweet me. I love big booty Latinas in all caps on the BE Hey account. listen we, have, we got plans soon. We got work some things out uh, uh, then we'll, yeah. we'll, we'll, we'll i have some plans for some, some behemoth twitter workshop <clears throat> all right so honestly I that's a good listen wait, wait 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 sorry i just the, remember this because it just went in my head in the future like when we do start doing stuff with it we should do a behemoth twitter workshop as well every weekend or every oh, podcast sorry yeah, that's that could be good, good. Yeah, okay. and, Sorry, ahead, and the worst tweet from our session gets put on the <laughs> Oh, that's no, what we like want. Today, the worst the tweet. Twitter could you just do want to stay relevant, don't you? With so Ignoble? much more fun. Like that's Dude, a why are you BD on my <laughs> ass today, Elisa? You're fucking just like <laughs> no, you've he, taken he, out like a the, 12 the, inch American just flag the... dildo and just like just putting it all 12 inches inside me and an extra it's one white, finger too. Oh, um, T Papa's tweet would have been perfect for the base the. Account. No, the Behe account. The Behe account. You can do the base Dude. account as well. We could tweet off there we also. The base account we should well probably. Yeah. But like the worst tweets. I would love I to see the worst tweets. So many drafts in my tweets, but they're always they're all so blunt and like 
obviously jokes and just outlandish that I'm like always scared to post them. What do you think Max's Twitter is? Yeah, my drafts are a waste. Yeah, of but do you, I don't know. Do you have anything else? Do you have anything else, or was it just the the pirate? The guy, the pirate. I, that that's pretty much it. I'm not gonna lie. It's pretty, it's pretty much We've it. been busy. Honestly, my Twitter have... will return when I'm not traveling again, dude. Unless do I you have anything noble? Nothing that I think it, it'll it would get blurred out if I say it on. All righty, we ready to tweet, my friends. Oh, so three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. Should I do season as the whole word or S Z N? I like S Z N for sure. S Z N for sure. S Z N, yeah. okay. And all caps or no caps? No, no caps. No caps, like at okay. all. Okay. Got you. Like girl vibes. Put like a sun emoji and the nail time or something. Oh, a sun emoji is good too. I didn't Ooh, think about that. Smart. Thank you. Taking my tweet to new levels. People are gonna like, what the fuck, Elisa? Every time I don't tweet very often, but every time I do, I feel like people are like, what the fuck? I mean, that's the kind of Twitter you want, though, honestly. I'm it's like, hey, I'm going live, here. or hey, I need to suck a dick for a tax deduction. Like, that's that's a good like ratio, I think. I mean, but that's for like real, is that a thing? For sure. That's definitely yeah. a thing. Also, remember, if you do not file your taxes, that's the only way they can lock you up. But if you do file them and lie, they can lock you up. Today's advice for me. Uh, I think that's going to do it for the regular podcast. Uh, I was going to ask Ignoble to take us out, but that's probably a bad idea. Uh, Elisa, take us out. What do I do? Don't skip. We have some news for you because we have recently reworked our entire podcast format. We will still be conducting one normal podcast a week, but now tier one patrons will have access to a weekly exclusive Patreon podcast that's going to be even more based and more after dark we've also updated our other tiers to include perks that allow you to directly interact with the podcast and influence the topics that we speak about the patreon will be linked in the description below